to know how the mechanism works on this Titanic submersible model because I'm taking the switch out because I broke the switch. I already fixed it, but still, I broke the switchy. And if it doesn't work, it's magnet fussy time. It's f time for fussing with magnets. <coughs> So, let's see how the boat works. So, there are watertight compartments in there. And when you open this hole up, you can see that there is a hole in there. Which lets the water in. And it spills into those compartments in there. And there's a hole in there somewhere. And then that switch ha that that's an air pocket that keeps the s that raises the switch when water touches it, and then the boat does a bang, boom, bangly boom, and does a break, break. Oh, also, they painted the funnels and the lifeboats and some of the bits over there and these back compartment things. Oh, and that funnel area. I also did the same on Britannic. And I forgot to mention I painted the lifeboats. And the masts. And the Titanic's lifeboats. I'm a very good painter, I guess. But, ooh, I forgot to mention. I had some stickers lying around from this one. Yeah, I had stickers lying around. They were the water decals. Let me go get the stand. Uh, anyway. Oh, also, while I was painting, I had a bit of an oopsie and spilled the paint. Here's the remnants of that. Anyway, I found, I put some decals on the boat so that way I didn't have to paint them. But for some reason, my camera is a ding dong and doesn't focus on anything. Uh. There we go. <laughs> Why does that work? Anyway, I tried to put the Liverpool sticker on the stern, but it didn't work. Probably because the black part is too low. Anyway, so there, there is the Titanic stand, and. As you can see, the bow fits. Wait, what? The bow balances. Anyway, the bow balances. When you spin the stand around, I used the, one of the stickers to do that. And it looks much better now. I would show you, but the ship is broken. Here, hold on. Let me try and get it on. Yeah, that's the best you're gonna get for now, until the ship is fixed. I'm not gonna test that until it's fully dried. Here's the glue I used. It is Loctite Extreme Glue. And I used it to hold the Britannic together, and... <laughs> well, there goes the funnel. Also, I painted them past... Wait a minute, I already mentioned that. Ooh, what's that? Anyway... I used Loctite, and that thing holds together like there's no tomorrow. Because usually when I drop it, the funnel breaks off. But this time it didn't. Yes. And if I drop Britannic on the floor, I'm just kidding, I'm not going to do that. But still, it would most likely hold together. Uh, I do not want to drop that piggy, though. Anyway, this submersible may be getting the rest of it. Yes, finally. And I also want to get some paint so I can restore it. Tell me if that's a good idea, please, anyway. I want to restore the boat to look good again. Yes. And we might be going to the flea market. I got this in, and I want to bring the tablet along so I can take picky picky pictures. Yes. Anyway. What was that noise? Anyway, I also forgot to mention, but I did that a while ago. Because under there, he's a Titanic sticker. 
I can do better than that. <coughs> anyway. Well, there's really nothing else to say. I don't have any updates with that. I don't have it. Ra e. Ra.